God Himself, He gets it to sign into the Roman Yeah, right. Yeah. I mean, going to your point, right? Going to your point about... So, can you hear me? Yeah, Yeah, going to your point about solutions, right? The issue that I find very troubling is we all know the solution to this, right? Our leaders, they all know the solution to it. They, they, They travel all over the world. They see how the systems in the UK, in the US, and all over the world works. They know how surveillance camera system works. They know how satellites work. They know how um, they. If I listened to part of the interview that they they mentioned about the Commodore on Channel TV, you know he talked about things that I know about because I, because I, I read I did a course in my university is about intelligence, so he talked about putting a blimp you know in the sky that can wash over these infrastructures, and he questioned why the why the Nigerian government does not have those those um, infrastructures to be able to to be able to protect our vital national security systems, you know, so our, the, the, what, what I find troubling is that our leaders, they know how to solve these things, they know the best and easy ways, you know, the, the, even the cheaper ways as well. But for example, look at Abuja, I think a couple of when Jonathan, Jonathan was in power, he already, he already did a contract for security cameras in Abuja. After he left, no one knows where, where those security cameras are. You know, but billions of naira was awarded for security cameras in the city of Abuja. But up to today, those cameras never got delivered. If they got delivered, I'm guessing they may not even be functioning at, at all at the moment. So those easy things that, that the government can do, you know, putting security cameras in, satellites. Like I, was listening to, I was listening to the guy, the, the agency guy, the agent of satellites in Nigeria. He was like, it was quite funny. And it was not funny at the same time when he says that if you have a director saying that it's by the grace of God that the satellite is working. I mean, it was it was funny. It's not funny in the sense that how do you, how, how are you relying on God for the satellites you send to to orbit to protect to protect us as Nigerians? If the satellite is not working, it's not working. God has nothing to do with it. You know, your job as a director is to make sure the satellite is working. You know, so those things that we can do liaising with our our foreign our foreign counterparts in America in the UK. You know, these guys that, that Nasser Arifat said that he was going to send them body bags. These same guys, you need you need them. You know? Yeah, because you need them. You need these same guys to help you. We were talking about a couple of weeks ago about the, the about them not sending us weapons. You can't, you can't after you've called them, you, you're gonna have, you, you can't after threatening them, come back again and say, please help us and help us give us weapons to fight Boko Haram. Because you need your foreign counterparts. They have better intelligence than we do. And like the Commodore said, right, the National Intelligence Agency, the DSS, they know who these guys are. They know this. They know who these sponsors of terrorism are. They know who they are. Who, who, who are backing them? So where are they getting the money? Where are they getting the money? Like they say, follow the money. Where are they getting the money for, to, to fund their terrorism? Where are they getting the money for the, the money to buy the arms and ammunition? Because someone is doing this things. You know, they can't just be. You know what? If you look at terrorism. One of the ways they find the terrorists are they're looking at who are backing these guys, who are their sponsors. You know, and I believe, like the Commodore said, I believe the government knows who the sponsors are. But like he said, many, many of them are high ranking officials in the federal government. Many of, them, many of them are even current senators. I mean, that's, that's, even, that's even a breaking news here. Like, you have people that are currently in the Senate, currently in the federal government, that are sponsoring terrorism against your fellow Nigerian. Do you know that it's not one step? It's crazy. I mean, it's, it's ridiculous. It's, it's, it's ridiculous. No, you, you I'm telling you now, I'm telling you that the Ministry, the Ministry of Defense huh, has declared him once again. 